Good afternoon, Wolfpack. I'm meteorologist David Dixon, the NCSU Weather Center. It is a typical spring weekend coming up with a few April showers, a warm temperatures, a little bit on the muggy side. And of course, it wouldn't be spring without our dear friend pollen. And I know it makes some people's lives, quite frankly, a living hell the next couple weeks as spring wears on. And this week is going to be no other as pollen counts are in the high to medium range for the rest of the weekend, especially on Friday as high winds are going to take that pollen out of the trees and put it into the air. And this is mainly going to be oak, ragweed, and pine. So it's going to be fairly severe, especially on Friday and a little bit less on Saturday and Sunday. So if you want to do anything outside and you're sensitive to allergies, be sure to push it later in the weekend. And a few of those spring showers, like I mentioned, will keep the pollen down for today as a low pressure system is bringing scattered showers for today. And I want to focus on this backdoor cold front. Depending on where it sits above or below the triangle, will either bring us a very hot and humid day or a fairly mild day. So those of you that sit below it, you're going to feel much milder temperatures. So it just depends where it sits in terms of Raleigh. That's either going to bring us mild or humid temperatures. I'm going to put it in the upper 70s because I think it's not going to reach us just yet. Few of us will see the cooler temperatures. Mostly cloudy throughout the entire region though, and it's going to begin to get a little bit colder over tonight with a few light and breezy winds, bring it into the mid 60s. By tomorrow, the winds and uh, rain have begun to pick up and we'll see widespread rain and some severe thunderstorms. We're putting it under a slight risk and the main dangers will be straight line winds and hail. But again, it is a slight risk and we're keeping our eyes on it. But for right now, we're just expecting pretty heavy rain and pretty gusty winds in the, the, from the south southwest from 10 to 20 miles per hour and much warmer temperatures in the lower 80s that is going to be pretty muggy. And once we get those few uh, rain showers out of the way, the rest of the weekend actually looks pretty nice. We have a cold front yet again Friday night dropping temperatures down into the 50s and that will give us a much nicer weekend with clearing up on Saturday and bring us lower temperatures in the lower 70s. 